bunnies. And I've got some blueberries to give them. So I'm gonna share some with them. Hopper knows blueberries well. I don't think Mala has ever had a blueberry. How about Sindel? Sometimes with the blueberries, like Hopper, he's had them many times, and they can't smell them for some reason very well, so you kind of might have to break the skin a little bit, take a little bite out of it, and then they'll take it. Dropped it. Oh, Hopper got it. Mala is very hesitant with uh, like fresh fruit snacks, and I think it's because she's never had them from her previous owners. Here's Pacquiao. Come on. <laughs> that was you got my finger too, you turd. But Hopper has had lots of fruits and vegetables, lots of fresh fruits and vegetables. He's my oldest rabbit, so he knows exactly how to eat them. Really? You guys are so nosy. But Hopper's also a messy eater, as you can see. Hey, Sindel. Come on, Mala, try it. There she goes. Oh, hey, they're trying to steal it. <laughs> Hopper, get your own. Here. Here, Sindel. Or, I mean, Mala. All of our rabbits are named after Star Wars characters. So, um, Mala is named after Chewbacca's wife. And then Hopper is actually Luke Skyhopper is his name. And then Sindel is from uh, Ewoks Battle of Endor. She's the cute little blonde curly haired girl. <laughs> Hopper, you are such a ham. They don't want to come out all the way. <laughs> come on out. We do let our, if we're out in the garden, we do let the rabbits out to free range with us, um, but you can see most of their diet is fresh grass. We move this tractor one to two times a day. Um, but they do, they can come out of the tractor and they'll just kind of stay around us or they'll make their way back to the tractor. Oh wow, Hopper, you pig. Um, but they, they do, they act like cats, like they stay nearby, but I don't like to let them out when the dog's out because they're really afraid of the dog when Bo is out. And they can have uh, pretty much as many blueberries as they'll eat when you're giving them a treat. They, because they're really smart and they'll stop when they've had enough. And I've never had an issue giving them berries or fruit until they don't want it anymore. Because they really just, they don't overeat it. Like they know how to uh, manage their own diet. So they're not going to overeat the fruit or the blueberries. Unless they're super hungry and that's the only thing you ever feed them, then of course they're going to eat with what's available. But because they have so many other things available like feed and grass and weeds all the time, they just, they are not going to fill up on the fruit. <laughs> they're so cute. Oh, they got scared by the goat sneeze. Seriously? Rude. <laughs> this is the rooster that I've been taming and you could tell he's pretty attached to me, follows me around everywhere. He's an ow. I don't like to feed him by hand because he pecks really hard. Let's just start throwing it down on the ground for him. Handle. See Luke Skyhopper, he's pretty, I think he's had enough now, so he's stopped. Have you had enough or you want some more? No, oh, he wants more. 
Hopper. Scare him away from me, Hopper. Here, Single. You want the blueberry? You want a blueberry? Well, I gave you one right there. I think the rabbits have had enough blueberries for now. Just let them eat some of the grass and weeds that are around here. Look, he tr keeps trying to get my shoe. Watch. Are you gonna be nice? Are you gonna be nice? Are you gonna be nice now? Come on. He's not really pecking hard. <laughs> Isn't that funny though? Still moody. You're still moody. Why are you still moody? <laughs> There Hopper goes over to the weeds. I'm gonna let him free range for a little bit. Now he's pecking at my jeans. You want some more fruit? You want some more fruit. He's really close to me. I don't trust him being behind my back like that. Go eat those. You want some more blueberries? No, they just want the fresh grass. It's time to move their tractor. You can see all the poo in there. And they've eaten the grass down for the most part. So I gotta call Garrett out here to move it. <laughs> What's funny, like when they're in the tractor or when they're in the house, I bring them in the house every night uh, just for socializing and for petting um, and they're fine in the house and they're fine if you pet them inside the tractor but when they're out free range and you pet them they get scared <laughs> or at least Mala does she's she's one of the a sketchier she gets a little sketchy and she's nibbling on my fingers and Hopper's already way in there so I gotta go check on him let me close these guys up real quick Hopper <laughs> Hopper with the ducks. What are you doing over here? What are you doing over here? He's like freedom. Food buffet. <laughs> Is that good? Is that good, Hoppy? Whitaker doesn't like blueberries. But Willow does. There you go, Whitaker. Is that good? I've got them in the pen right now to give the plants a rest. They've been eating up everything. Enough. What about my duckies? Want a blueberry? <laughs> and the guinea's turn. Oh, she doesn't like them. Oh no, the chickens ate one of my pumpkins. I still have this one though. And I think there's some over here. They're kind of being drowned out by the weeds. Oh, I've got one right there. It's kind of hidden. And one over here. I'm sure there's a bunch more 
in this mess. But the pumpkin plants have actually, oh no, the chickens got this pumpkin too. Darn it. The, only, the one year that I actually get pumpkins to grow. But the pumpkin vine's actually going into the pond. Look, there's even a pumpkin down there. <laughs> Good turkey. We're just checking him out to see if he, if it's gonna be a boy or a girl. And I don't see much of a mohawk on the back of his head, so I think he might be a boy. Here's what his tail feathers look like. I'm hoping he's a boy. Um, you guys probably watched the video where we got two of these. We actually lost one to a predator, which is so super sad. Um, but not this weekend. Next weekend, we're actually getting another trio of royal palms. So he won't be lonely for long. He's been hanging out with the chickens. Haven't you? <laughs>